Well, this is um, my office. Principal flautist Joshua Smith is used to the spotlight of Severance Hall. This is my chair. And uh, you can see I'm fairly close to the conductor and very much in the, in the, in the very center of, of the action. But being center of one stage is no longer enough, no matter how prestigious. Orchestras across the country are struggling to make ends meet because audience habits are changing. People have different values today and those values don't fit well with the subscription business model that the orchestra industry embraced and, and, and profited from greatly in the middle 20th century. They want to choose when they come to a symphony orchestra, they want to choose where, where they'll hear the symphony orchestra, um, they want to have more choice. For Joshua, that means breaking down barriers to find new venues and new audiences. Welcome to the Happy Dog. It's a working class bar in a working class neighborhood. And, and Severance Hall is, you know, the, the sort of height of how you see an orchestra in, in action. And we're sort of playing with the idea of mixing the two experiences. first couple of times we did this, our regular clientele would walk in and they'd have this startled look on their face when they saw it. Um, but what we found is it's great music and, and these are some of the best in the world at doing it. And you don't have to know anything about classical music to form that connection. Great music is great music and it just resonates. Regular customer John Guest is one of the Happy Dog converts. My first true experience with classical music was here at the Happy Dog. I was able to be introduced to classical music, not just by listening to the music, but having the folks who are on stage actually provide a little narration, a little tutoring on what I should be listening for, what I should hear. But while Cleveland Orchestra needs people like him, the Happy Dog neighborhood needs the orchestra just as much. Having a world-class orchestra on the doorstep offers a unique opportunity to use the arts to stimulate the local economy. If people come here to listen to the music or go to a play, they might also call in at the local coffee shop. And if they like what they get, they'll probably come back. And as a resident of this growing neighborhood, what does John Guest spend his money on now? Tickets to Severance Hall.